one of the cool things about college football and what makes it unique is like on any given Saturday, you go to a stadium and you can feel the electricity. I mean, the NFL has it too, but it's just a little bit different. And so we want to get that nailed both on the atmosphere side as well as from the gameplay side. Sidelines are going to be populated. You're going to see cheerleaders on the sides. Um, the cheerleaders are going to be performing stunts, whereas like on the PS2 and the Xbox, it used to be a cutscene. Now you'll be driving down the field and you'll see a cheerleader standing up and doing stuff. He's all the way. Touchdown. You're going to have much more control than you ever have had in the past. Uh, when you're doing your jukes. Now you can go into a juke and where the animation would typically play out, you can now start another juke to go back the other way. So the best way to kind of think of it is when you look at like Barry Sanders. So on the left analog stick, we'll have moves there for the first time. So you can do a shimmy sidestep back and forth. So if you rotate left and someone's coming at you, you can actually change the direction at a 100 degree angle to go back the other way and avoid the tackle where in the past you kind of had to wait for that animation to play out which is why you'd get tackled. So now you have complete control to go in, make the play and keep on moving. When you're playing head to head with a buddy in the room with you, you want to be able to bluff and be able to set up situations and so one little tidbit that we will provide is play art. So if you and I are playing head to head and I show my play to run up the middle you know what you're going to do and you're going to crowd the line. So we're going to give you the ability to now to fake that. So I may have a screen pass set up, but I'll fake the bluff up the middle. He'll give it off here. He has some room. One of the things that you're going to see is more arm tackles, more over pursuit angles. So on the offensive side, you've got to make sure that you're taking the right angle. Same holds true on the defensive side. You've got to be able to, to close those lanes and, and get on that trajectory. Completely new player models, so every year now since we've been on Next Gen, we've had new player models. We always want to continue to be as authentic as possible. Your linemen are going to be, you know, some of them are going to be a little more out of shape, but yet still have some of that muscle, as opposed to when you look at an NFL caliber player who's going to be a lot more toned up. One of the things that I think was actually a good thing that we need to continue to grow on is like Dynasty Mode last year. Completely new recruiting engine, uh, but I think maybe it was probably a little intimidating for some folks, so we want to make sure it's a little bit more accessible. So those are some of the things we're going to address this year to make sure that uh, fans can jump in and enjoy that experience. All the things that we've always talked about, like from, a, from both Dynasty and Campus Legend, you know, we're going to address those, and uh, they'll definitely be back in the game this year with uh, some new surprises that I think the fans will like, but can't talk about them just yet. Questionable play calling there by the coaching staff. We're going to be on the Wii for the first time this year. We'll be on the PS3, the 360, the PlayStation 2. Uh, we'll also have a mobile game, and we'll be in stores July 15th. Got some open field. Touchdown, Georgia!